We're back in town, but we should be at work. This is part 12 of Dragon Quest IV, Chapters of the Chosen. And yeah, we now have Torniko joining our party. And with our work done, it's time for us to head south, because... Yeah, we're not done yet. Yep. Also, we finally have a ship we can use to ride. Which is nice. Makes it so much more fun this way. And it looks like we're about to fight some new enemies. Metal Scorpions. And these guys hit hard. Now let them all burn. Yeah, now let's let's make sure you singe. So much for that. And yes, the metal scorpions attack twice. You're going to be expecting a lot of these enemies. Okay, who leveled up? Torniko is now level 11. Very good. Time for us to enter the next town. The town of Mintos. Hey, I think I know this place. Why, I surely do know it. This here is Mintos, as in Mintos, home of the infamous Conrad Ilton. Folks call him the god of trade, you know. Gee, um, this may come a bit sudden for y'all, but, you know, I've had a hawk killing time traveling around with you fine people, and for that I'll always be mighty thankful. But it's my dream to follow in my daddy, Hank Hoffman Sr.'s footsteps, and open up a fine end of my own. Mintos is home of the god of trade, Conrad Ilton. He's ace high, and that's for sure. It'd be fine as Queen Grave if I can learn a thing or two from him. I know it's a mite selfish of me and all, but I gotta ask you anyway, Solo. Would it be okay if we leave you apart at ways? It'd mean the world to me to stay on here. Why, thank you. I'll never forget you folks, you hear? And I'll never forget how important it is to have faith in your fellow man, either. You take care now, Mary Lou. I'll be praying for y'all to have a safe trip. Yeah, so now he leaves the party. Nice, we get ourselves some items, a Moonward Bulb. Just gotta find a well somewhere. Nice, we got ourselves a Mini Metal. Oh nice, we get a Scale Shield. Yeah, we gotta go around. Yeah, there is some slowdown here with this. And another mini metal. Nice, we get a seed of resilience. Yeah, cautery sword. That's expensive. But let's check on the armor side first, because I want to make sure. Torniko will not be in the party for much longer. But a pole plate armor? Hmm, that can do. Yes, reorganize my items. I need to make sure it gets the Iron Helmet.
That did it. Gotta make sure I'm strong enough for what lies ahead. Finally, I can sell this off. Yeah, but we both have golden tiaras. Let's hold on to that just in case. Nah, I'd rather sell it off to make some cash. And I don't need the scale shield either. either. And we don't need the hunter's bow. And let's get sell the boxer shorts. Yeah, I'm only gonna be picking my main four. Tornico's only a temporary, and we need to get a cautery sword. Transfer to the bot to the bag. Very good. Yeah, we need to make sure. Now let's head to the second floor of the inn, because there's an item we need to get. Nice, a seed of wisdom. And let's get some needed rest. Because now I gotta grind up to get a cautery sword. Yeah, it's not like there's much else to do. Believe you me, in order for me to make sure I be stronger, this is the only way how. You're gonna lower defenses? What do you have against me, guys? Seriously, they got a pick on the healer? Nah. Very good. The cautery sword's like 3,500. And the ratatatax appear. Nice job. That makes it easy. And having Tornico around will certainly help me get more money. Because I need at least 3,500. And plus his high luck also helps. Desperate attack! Oh dear god. Damn, that gotta hurt.
Good, not dealing with that. Paralysis always works. Metal Scorpion again. Good job. Yeah, we also supposed to meet up with this guy. You what? You want to ask if I'm the geezer who knows a lot about the ocean? You muppet, I only know, I don't only know about the ocean. I know everything there is to know about everything. I ain't got time for lightweights. Do your homework properly next time before you start asking questions. No. Nice answer. Yep, I don't only know about the ocean. I know everything there is to know about everything. The name's Conrad Ilton. That's Ilton with an edge. I say you've got promise, son. So reckon your game? Wanna have a bash in my little test? Nice, here's the question. What's the single most important thing when it comes to business? I couldn't have said it better myself. You're right. Silence is golden, as they say. Tell you what, I'll give you an old treasure map for doing so well. I come across it when I was a nipper, but I never did figure out what the treasure was. It's yours. Nice, we got a treasure map. Maybe you'll be able to find the treasure, right? You should give it a go. Let's head for the inn. On the southeastern side of the Syric continent lies the tiny empire of Parthenia, renowned for its miraculous medicinal crops. When I mentioned it to the princess who was staying at the inn, she dashed off without another word. She mean he means Alina! As you are seeing, my traveling fellow is very sickened. Our mistress, the royal Sarevna Alana, has gone alone to locate medicines. I am concerning for her safety also. I know it is eccentric to request favor from a strange person, but I am seeing you have kind heart. Will you locate some banana furry and give to her some assistance? Yoy! Thank you so very much. I am Doug Boya. I will also accompany with you. Now Boya joins our party. Very well. I am going a little advanced to request from innkeeper nursing of Kiryu. I am waiting afterwards that you come out the wagon. See you momentarily. Ugh, yep, he's out cold. We gotta help him. Let's rest up, and then head for the Empire of Parthenia. Time for us to head right. Looking at the map up above, which you guys can't see, there's basically like an X. Really? That's a bit nuts. I guess his gadabout skills have come in very handy. Now burn! Who level up this time? Mina. She's now 15. And... Torniko is now level 12. She learns a new spell. Whistle. And it can... And yes... Basically, with Torniko and your party, you can be able to find items. If you're lucky enough. Yeah, we can't reach that, so we'll have to ignore it for now. You think reducing defenses will help you? Not a chance.
Yes, my and me are staying on the party for a while until we get our hands on Alana. Maya staying permanently, she can hit like a truck with her magic power. Now I want I gotta wonder if every member of the party gets experience equally. And this? Yep, this way sealed off. Can't do much. If you travel a long way southeast of here, you'll come to the Empire of Parthenia. Noted. <laughs> oh dear. Better start getting rid of the getting rid of the small fries. Good, that takes care of one salamander fry. One decides to run away like a wuss. Well, your funeral, I guess. There's the town. But they have the first strike. Time to go on the offensive. Yeah, take that. Seriously. Now we reach the Empire of Parthenia. Nice, we get ourselves a seat of magic. And some pocket change. There's not really much, but we could use this time to rest. Forty coins, that's worth the risk. Now to find out what's happened here. A scarecrow? Welcome, strangers. I am Claudius, Emperor of Parthenia. Though times have been hard since we lost our fever few crop. My predecessor, Emperor Crescentius, secreted away some of the precious fever few seeds in the Imperial Pantry south of here but monsters have taken up residence there now. The pantry is all but inaccessible. My empire is crippled, so I must apologize, sir. If only I had some fever fuses, I would gladly grant your wish. Let's put this armor in the bag. Yeah, let's also get some medicinal herbs for her solo. Just gotta keep it going. Yeah, at least carry six. Because even though you have healing spells, your MP is the uh, a different story. Alright, now it's with that done, it's time for us to head south.
Mushroom Mages. Let's whoosh it all away. Well, we got rid of one. Well, that was simple. Good job, guys. Now it's time we enter the Imperial Parthenian Pantry. So this is Gateways to be found these fever few seed. Alana! That door, it is locked. Very well. Hiya! Damn, girl! Door is no longer locked. We can go. I thought Miss Elena had the thief's key. I suppose she just really wanted to kick it down, eh? Oh well, the result's the same, I suppose. On we go. Do they even notice we're here? I don't think they do. Oh my god, they brought these things back. Alright, we get a seat of agility. Vampire battlers. Seriously, they're not that difficult. <coughs> Sorry. Yeah, it would a sore throat. Not to mention, you guys know I've been doing this playthrough for some time. I'm only doing one video a day. Now it's time we enter the floor. And now they're going in circles. Elena! I mind you're also searching this Fever Few Seed, but Fever Few Seed will be mine. Not if we beat you to it. And we get the Seed of Life. More vampire battlers! We need to take them down! Yes, I'm not a fan of the sliding stuff. Never was. Wow, you knocked down an enemy. That's hilarious. That's basically what it is, a goof-off. Good job, guys. Who leveled up? Tornico is now 13. And also that whistle ability? Yeah, that's gonna be massively helpful. Now let's head here and get this chest here. This nets us 800 coins, very nice. Oh no, we got some new enemies, some powy yowies. An ice breath? Oh dear god. That's not gonna be pleasant. Seriously, I hope you guys are looking forward to part one of Dragon Quest. Uh, I mean, I hope you guys are enjoying my playthrough of Dragon Quest 4. Besides, I wanna do all the Dragon Quest games. So that way, yeah. I can show everyone that Dragon Quest deserves more love and appreciation. Oh my god, wizards! No, wait. Oh, you like blowing things away with a whoosh attack.
Good. That should keep at least Maya alive. Oh, you bring more enemies? How about a sizzle instead? Now burn! Mostly. Mina, Maya, everyone, take their butts down, please. Yes, it's stripped by paralysis. Nice work, Maya. Yeah, you're gonna be my permanent member. Once I once we get Alana, I'm probably gonna have Alana replace Torniko. Let's see. Yes, yeah, Solo is now level 14. And he gains E back! Yes! That's gonna be definitely useful. And we gain the role of Serenity. Hmm, that might help. Protects the wearer while asleep or paralyzed. Good. Let's move this to the bag. Hmm, let's see where this, where does this lead? No, in order for me to do this, we need to find a way around. Which means in order for us to reach that part there, we're gonna have to go all the way around. Good job, guys. Okay, so now let's continue. Elena, you're gonna be walking around in circles at this rate. Very good. I thought it would paralyze the Power Yowie. Guess not. Just wait till I have to do Dragon Quest 5 and 6. That's gonna be a doozy. Let's get everyone healed up. All right, healed up and ready to go. Let's continue. We need to one touch the wall on the left here. Now once that's done, go down and take the stairs. Oh my God, now we're in a maze. Let's get the first chest. Nuts! Can of box! This thing can take a lot of punishment. Forty five points of damage. And it's done.
Yep, Maya is now 16. And she gains Drain Magic. Oh, that is so gonna be useful. Okay, so what what am I supposed to do? I figured it out. This one. Nice. We gained the fever fuse seed. Sorry, but we kind of be out on a toe it. And if we don't get out of here fast, we're going to be fried. Well, at least we're making sure we get it done. Really, Salamander fries fire fireballs now? Yeah, good riddance. Now we gotta deal with the infernal armors. Well, at least we got the we at least got that done. Very good. Now we're set. Let's move. Looks like they left. That doesn't re that dungeon really wasn't that long. Well, I guess some whooshing we'll have to do for now. Well, many of the enemies are frozen in fear, which means we get free turns. Thanks for waking my up. take care of these guys. Wow, these fights can get really taxing. Yeah, be gone. Annoying is what they are. Now let's head back to the town. 
Now we gotta deal with some imps. Hmm, who leveled up this time? Tornico's now 14. Very nice. Time to deliver the goods to our fabled king. G -g Goddess! Fever few seeds at last! Quickly now, you must store them in the store. They shan't take long to grow. Thank you, good sir. You have saved the empire. I should like you to take a few fever fruit root with you as a trophy of this most auspicious occasion. We're gonna need that. All right, now with that done, let us zoom. Let us zoom to Mentos. I could not find nothing. I abandoned my hopes, but now I am so much happy. Hurry, you must give to give fever few root at Kiryu. Nice, he finally makes a full recovery. Sarevna Alana, you are here! Thanks to the goddess, you are woken again! I am so very much ashamed. My duty it was for protecting you, but... Never mind anymore, Kiryu! We must to continue our voyage and locate the Sarah the Manslayer! Huh? What you are saying? Oh, you are also searching the Sarah the Manslayer? It appears the village Solo is living in previously suffered attack by this sorrow. Perhaps it would be wise if... I have idea! We must travel together. The more people we are, the merrier we are. And now Alana and Kirio have joined our party. Nice. And yes, Alana's joining our party. Wait a minute. I know I shouldn't have been listening in, but I'm afraid I couldn't help myself. It sounds like we have the hero who will save the world among us, the great Solo. That chap who was staying here before, Ragnar McRyan, said something about how he was looking for a hero. If my memory serves me correctly, he was off to the Palace de Leon, way over in Levisio to the west. Thanks for that. I've already been left in charge of you, you know. There ain't no stopping me now. Y'all have a safe trip you now, you hear? Okay, time to set up the lineup. Oh, wait. We need to leave this place. Yep, let's give Soul the cautery sword. We'll put it in the bag. Yep, all we're missing is Ragnar McRyan. He's the last party member. Nice, now that we got that, let's saw off a steel broadsword we don't need. Okay. 
Now with that done, we need to sail to Palais de Leon. And that's a, and that's westward. Where's our ship? Oh yeah. Solo. Maya. Having a secondary healer would work, but she's better because she has mid heal. Now I gotta wonder if there, if you could be able to like level up more. Ah, here we go. Yup, Alanus fourteen, and she has high agility too. Very nice. Now we gotta sail westward. Yeah, the music is just soothing to listen. And we got some Tusketeers to fight. Yeah, but they don't take that much damage. Yeah, Alan is the fastest. I gotta boost solo speed at least. Wow, they can take a lot of punishment. Nice, the Tusketeer has fallen. We made it. We need to set ourselves for Palais de Leon. Now we got some new enemies, some wild beasts. Having a secondary, having two healers is going to help. Elena raise hell. Not a chance. Yes, we're now in Laissez-Faire. Which means we need to head up north to Palais de Leon. We had to take a little detour. I wonder if it means I can be able to get improved, stat improved gear. Guess not.
Looks like we'll have to head up north. We have a lot of enemies to fight. Let's give it a big bang. That critical hit though, sweet Jesus! Sweet mother of... 66 damage?! No, no, no. <laughs> Defend! Elena, take down that infernal armor! You are not dying today. All hands focus on the wild beast. Good. That was a waste. What a pain! Okay, now let's take the ship. Now we gotta take on some devil fish. Ice breath, really? Come on, man! Yeah, these things attack twice per turn. Which actually makes this a little bit upsetting. It's never fun! Maya... Maya, that's a bit much. Seriously. Finally made it. Unfortunately, the place itself's been locked down. Hello, my name's Healy. I'm a Globetrotter, too. Can't you do something to help my friend Ragnar? They've taken him away inside the castle. If only I had that magic key, I could squeeze my way inside and save him. Yes, an old group friend of mine told me all about the magic key. She lives underground in Obatumad. Okay, so we got that done. Let's head here. We might get some answers. Wait, what? The magic key, you say? No, I've never come across anything like that. For sale in my shop, but it existed. Oh yes, I'm sure of that. In fact, I heard Alchemist had perfected the recipe for making magic keys. Now, where did I hear that again? Oh yes, that's right. There used to be an alchemist in a little village south of here. It's called Abatumond now, I think. I see. So it seems we now have to reach Abatumond. We'll just have to head there. Oh yeah, we have to head to a bot so we can get new weapons and stuff. Well, that wasn't going to make us much. Imps. Guess we're going to have to fight.
Ice Breath, really? Nice. That's over and done with. 400 experience. That is a lot. I may have to take the time to grind off screen. But this will most likely mean disconnecting this thing from the DS. From the 3DS. I only hope that everyone gets experience. Dragon Pups. And anyone got to level up? Mina is now 16. And that is, that's impressive. All right, we made it to a bot du monde. That's where we have to be. There's a weapon shop inside that inn. I'm a traveling salesman. I was at the Desert Bazaar and Maelstrom until recently, but that's finished now. So I'm always south to laissez-faire. Anyway, see who's having a little chat. Perhaps we can do some business. They added a battle axe. Borea would get the Cloak of Evasion, but all the others are not that great. So I'll just waste money on getting the Iron Mask. Besides, I need to make sure my team is strong enough, and I have to save up to get the Battle Axe. Because the Cautery Sword just ain't gonna cut it. Alright, let's sell off a scale shield that we got. And this fur coat, too. We got the thief's key along with it. Alright, that should do it. Yeah, I was afraid of this. Now I gotta transfer six at least. Yeah, this just sucks. And I'll add four to each on each one. So that way they can consistently heal. Yeah, let Alan hold on to five. Yeah, and if you have Maya and Mina in your lineup, yeah, there, you get to rest for free.
Now we gotta head to this house. Don't be mean to me. I'm not a bad slime, you know, I promise. See, I'll even tell you something. This wasn't Mr. Mahabala's only laboratory. He had another super squishy one. It was in the cave of the West. The magic key's there, Goo. It'll be useful to you. We need to head to the Gupta Goofa Goof Cave. And it's west of this place. But either way, we're gonna wrap this up for now. Because, yeah, I might have to grind a little bit if I'm gonna have any chance. Just a little. I gotta make sure to at least have beyond 16. But there is no, no place. That's okay. Let us head to Havre Leon and save there. So yeah, that's going to be it for this part of Dragon Quest IV. We'll be heading for the Gupta Gupa in part 13. If you enjoyed this, please be sure to hit the like button, it means a lot. Please don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, and click the bell. I will see you in the next. This is Mega Man NG signing off, peace out. Now if you'll excuse me, I've got some work to do. See you then.